Hi, Bruce from Safari. Shout out to Unimog uh, owners. This is for Glenn and Mary Wynne Austin have rebuilt an old uh, Unimog, all 48 volt. We've got the four of the floor mounted batteries here work perfectly for the trucks down below. We've got a 24 volt Scotty because we're putting a 200 amp alternator um, into the Unimog. And then over here, we've added in the digital switching that you can see here and um, all the Victron gear. And we've got a 6000 multi RS here. Now this Victron screen is going to go. That's just for commissioning and we're using our new integrated uh, touch display. Now, what will happen in the Unimog, there's this uh, head unit here will be sitting into the Unimog, and that will give them navigation, where to with all the HEMA maps, the, the sound, the fusion sound, and they'll have two speakers in the back of the camper, two in the front of the cab to give them full, and then on the actual digital control, we come up here on the digital control, I've gone straight into the inclimiter display, but then we've got all the Victron gear uh, integrated in. We've actually got Scotty integrated in here as well. All the solar integrated in. So when you touch one of these, um, then they're going to appear over here, all the performance, alternator temperature, the whole lot. So we've got an excellent uh, total integrated display. All the switches come on here. I've got locked into the lights over there at the moment for testing. Uh, that's all working at the moment. And just a reminder that when the lights come on, um, that you can see here, the actual wattage for the light appears. And as I dim that light down, the percentage appears where it'll slowly dim down. So you can see we're now at 70%, 49%, and the amount of watts used are the same. This is all digital fusing. If there's a short circuit, that fuse will go red. And I just touch it like that to reset the fuse. So we go back to the main display here. So that integrated display replaces the Touch 70 display. We don't need that anymore and we've got everything coming up in here including in the unimog we'll have the tire pressure monitoring system running as well as well as the inclimiter um, i've got to say that for a compact system so just look at the size of that this has basically got the works in terms of uh, switching monitoring control navigation sound um, and also the phone app that you'll see in the um, other video that i'm going to do today i've got to say how good is that